Students in Lowell are getting an extra day off because of the cold. Lowell High School is closed today after students complained about freezing cold rooms inside. WBZ's Lisa Greshi reports from Lowell. Parents say classrooms here at Lowell High School have been sitting at frigid temperatures, and now students are sitting this one out at home. Lowell High School closing its doors to students today. Staff inside had no comment about what the plan is from here. And for parents like Ann Draper, the frustration is only growing. Then what about the day after that? Do we just keep them home? Yeah. And in protest until it's fixed? What do you do? Parents stressing, we aren't talking temperatures in the 50s or 60s. Yeah. These are freezing temperatures. Um, a few weeks ago, it was 39 degrees in my son's first class. Students doing all they can to keep warm in class, some taking pictures of their hands turning purple. Some kids I've seen wearing hats or wearing blankets from home to cope with it. Freshman Musa Dienta says at this point it's hard to learn anything in class. Other students literally struggling to sit still, even calling their parents to dismiss them from school or not showing up at all. He said it was nearly impossible to concentrate in class. Um, all anyone was thinking about was how to stop shivering. Uh, how to get through the class, just sitting still. Parents and students are now calling on the school to do something and fast, especially because this is only the beginning of what could be a very long winter. I was actually talking to my mom before, like, um, I didn't want to go to school tomorrow because how cold it was. We want the kids to be in school. We want them to be learning, but at what point, as a parent, do you say to yourself, I can't send them there in good faith, let them sit in 30 degree classrooms all day long. The headmaster tells us they're doing everything they can to heat this school back up, and parents are hoping for a long term fix. Reporting in Lowell, Lisa Greshi, WBZ News.